hi guys today we are going to see a review or a comparison about windows 8 and windows 8.1 operating system so let's start first of all we can see about windows 8 operating system so this is a windows 8 operating system with 1 GB of RAM and this is a Windows 8 Pro and it was a 64 bit operating system. So let's see. So, first of all, we can see where it lags. Windows 8 operating system doesn't have start menu. So, how do we need to go to the metro app? So, we need to go to this corner and click it and there comes the start menu and this start menu we you can see all the metro apps here which cannot be resized as yourself like that we do in uh, windows 8.1 operating system so just a minute so it was a bit difficult to go so going to this operating system for opening the start menu it makes me to go to the corner of the screen and i need to exactly click the corner of the screen to open the start menu and here if I want to remove this application I just need to right click here and just select and pin well it was removing well no problem and if I want to make it smaller I can right click and uh, select smaller so that it may, it may get smaller but uh, still it was not getting more smaller so after that after that if you want to remove this app you can just simply select and we can uninstall it overall it will get uninstalled and again if i want to go to the desktop i need to click this then only i can go to the desktop i just click desktop and i have gone to the desktop but in windows 8.1 operating system it do has a start menu tell the configuration what i'm using it has a windows 8.1 pro gb 64 bit operating system if you want to go to the metro app that is a start screen i need to go to the start button since it has the start button i just need to click the start button it opens the start menu and here if i want to open sorry just i will open it again if you want to resize this time i'm just going to resize it to ask for more options one is larger and medium and i can also make it smaller uh, this is a bit different from windows 8 and windows 8.1 and moreover we have a small button here let's see what it does yeah it was taking us to the apps so that we can easily scroll and we can easily look out what are the apps we have to we are having here and if you want to open the calculator it just takes us to the desktop yeah you can easily go to the desktop and if you want to go to the desktop you can go to the desktop by clicking this desktop app or else you can simply come to this corner and you just click it and it will open the desktop so no problem in that so it was a bit uh, making us easy to go to the desktop and the animation is also too fast in compared to windows in 
compared to Windows 8 operating system. So it was a bit fast. So let's see what Windows 8 does. So if you see you can see the difference between the animation without using the start menu it makes you to take some time to open the metro apps. So right now I'm going to the show you some of the differences between the Windows 8 and 8.1 animation part. So I'm just you see I'm just going to open you a calendar application. So if you want to so if you want to open the app again it was taking some time and compared to Windows 8.1 but I'll just open a Windows 8.1 and I will show you what it is yeah here you can see if you just drag here you can see the desktop and everything what you can see here yeah, it was taking only small amount of time that is also a difference and one more thing I need to show you is if you just move to the top and if you just drag the screen here you can keep it here and you can adjust like this you can just drag and drop here so that it makes you to move the screen half uh, window or a full window but in windows 8 you can simply see the can just simply drag the application down to close this for example if you just open this application and just go to the top and simply drag it to the bottom to close it if you want to uh, you open another window so I have opened two window here I just need to make this Yes. I'm just it was making me it was taking me so much time to do this but in Windows 8 it was simply it can be simply done as you see I'm just going here Just keep it here. See, this can be easily done here. And I can work on. Mm, you can move here. So in this part, Windows 8 was something difficult when using the mouse. 
but windows 8.1 it, it was somewhat uh, easy to use the mouse that's what i want to say and one more thing i need to show you is if you just open it here you can see there are six folders what you have in the my computer this is your user documents what you have in your my computer user and your profile you see here this is what you have here and and the my computer here was renamed to this PC let's see in Windows 8 you see here it was showing as a computer but in Windows 8.1 it was renamed to this PC and here also it will not show you the user profiles in the my computer so this is somewhat different and let's see the charm bar and if you go to the settings you can see the charm bar here if you click change settings it will open the pc settings here it was something difficult in in windows 8 operating system that makes you to analyze everything what you are doing before changing the settings but in windows 8.1 operating system it was somewhat if you go there if you go to the settings go to the change settings in windows 8.1 it will be somewhat easy for you to analyze all the settings in one place the whole control menu of the windows operating system was seen here and what are the things you can do in the control menu you can do it in this pc settings which was modified in the windows 8.1 operating system and here you can also see the Internet Explorer here the latest version of the Internet Explorer was installed in the Windows 8.1 operating system and the version is 11 and in Windows 8 operating system it was 10 so I'm just going to close this one go to the desktop is opening the Internet Explorer <laughs> yeah uh, since it was the first time opening it will take some time I will just open yeah it's a Windows 8.1 I will just show you yeah it was a Windows 8.1 here you can see the Internet Explorer 11 version in Windows 8 operating system it will be here it will be 10th version Internet Explorer 10 is different from Internet Explorer 11 and the Internet Explorer 11 was recently released for Windows 8 and Windows 7 also you can also download the Internet Explorer 11 for Windows 7 operating system it was available in the Microsoft website and these are the main differences between Windows 8 and Windows 8.1 operating system the video may not be clear clarity because I am using the virtual machines for switching between here and there so it may lag in some places so sorry for that so before using that I have also told you about what is the main mouse movements between the Windows 8 and Windows 8.1 operating system this is the pro version of the Windows 8 so it is similar to that of the Windows 8.1 also the enterprise version also has the same settings and everything like this and using the Windows 8 is somewhat bit lagging for the mouse usage but a uh, Windows 8 
0.1 operating system has a good mouse usage so in my opinion I can tell you you can go for the Windows 8.1 operating system when comparing about the speed between both these operating system the speed of Windows 8.1 was relatively more when compared to the Windows 8 operating system so you can if you are if you are going to buy a Windows operating system you can go for a Windows 8.1 operating system because it was smooth it was fast and the mouse usage was a bit more clarity you can do whatever you want with the help of the start menu like we are doing in the Windows 8 so I will suggest you to go to Windows 8 point one operating system so thank you for watching